It's like a place right out of a storybook. There we go. it. Welcome back. Have you finished your assignments? Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. And you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice our restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop Quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements. Professor, do you have a moment? Yes, what is it? In class, I heard you mention the Toyohashi Quidditch team. I did. The Toyohashi Tengu are from Japan. Dominant, known for their rigorous training. They practice near the Mahutokoro School of Magic, often battling both tempestuous seas and violent storms in addition to each other. Tournament play is almost always easier for the Tengu than their training sessions. I take it you're a fan. Fan? 
I was being groomed to play on their team. And I would have been a Tengu if not for a bit of bad luck. If you were that good, I can't believe a bit of bad luck could end your entire Quidditch career. I was excellent. My ability on a broom had nothing to do with what happened. I was betrayed by someone I trusted. Myself. I did not see clearly and I paid a dear price. My best friend Asuka and I were being groomed to play on the team together. I as keeper and she as chaser. She was breathtaking. She once corkscrewed through three players and scored before they even turned their heads. But as tryouts for the Tengu got closer, she panicked. I did not realize the extent of her panic until it was too late. She wanted so desperately for both of us to play together that she had slipped Felix Felicis into our tea before we were to show them our skills. What is Felix Felicis? A potion? Also known as liquid luck. And it is illegal in all wizarding sports. I knew within minutes that something was different. I had never played so well. And Asuka was playing more beautifully than I had ever seen. When I confronted her afterwards, she admitted what she had done. I withdrew from consideration immediately. But it wasn't your fault. You didn't know about the potion in the tea. It does not matter. My flying that day was not my own. I could not live with myself. So I withdrew and explained to them why. I burned my broom in disgrace. What happened to Asuka? Did she burn her broom as well? Asuka played for the Tengu for two seasons. You didn't report her? Tell them what she'd done? Her fate was not mine to decide. My fate is in my hands, as your fate is in yours. Thank you, Professor. I shall remember what you've told me. Arrest the momentum. That's it. Keep it up. Arrest the momentum. Did I never learn how to swim? Going for a swim? Goodness, no. Though I'm beginning to think I really should learn how to swim. Can't very well be liaison to the mer people if I don't know how to swim. You're a liaison to the mer people? Well, not technically, no. At least not yet. The position doesn't actually exist at the moment, but I have a plan to change that. I'm Nerida, by the way. Nerida Roberts. We didn't officially meet, but we dueled in the Crossed Wands Club. Yes, of course. Good to see you again. And you. You seem quite interested in mer people. I am. And they're as misunderstood and disregarded by wizard kind as goblins and centaurs are. I feel that if goblins and centaurs have liaison officers at the Ministry, then the mer people should have one too. I'm impressed. I think reaching out to the Mer people is a grand idea. You do? Oh, thank you. Of course, I haven't exactly done anything just yet. I presented them with a gift a few weeks ago, and they wanted to leave me one as well, in one of their caves. Reciprocity and an offer to visit. I tried telling them I couldn't swim, but I'm afraid that bit got lost in translation. Mermish really is tricky. What is it about the Mer people that interests you so much? Oh, I can't begin to tell you how brilliant they are. I mean, rumour is that tales about them have infiltrated even the Muggle world. 
The oldest known mer people, sirens, come from Greece. And of course, Scotland has selkies and Ireland is home to merrows. I could go on for ages about them. Their glorious underwater communities, domestication of sea life, their art and music. It's a travesty how little is understood about them. What do you imagine a liaison to the mer people would do? Oh, so many things. I want to know everything I can about them. After I've mastered swimming, I perfect my mermish, of course. And I'd share with them anything they wanted to know about wizard kind. My hope is that by understanding each other better, both of our societies could grow. How has wizard kind fallen short in its treatment of mer people? Well, we've consistently deigned mer people as being beneath us despite the many similarities between our cultures. One can hardly blame them for declining being status by the ministry years ago. Who are we to classify those of such beauty and intelligence? Well, I can swim and could help you if you'd like. You'd really do that? Oh, thank you! Thank you, thank you! The last thing I want is for them to think I shunned their gift. Diplomacy is a delicate dance. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think you can dive down to their cave from just there in the water. I can't wait to... About what we discussed, Nerida. The mer people? Yes? I'm hoping you'll be able to dive down and retrieve the gift they left me. I really should look into games. Look at this place. Did the Mer people really leave Narada an artifact? Loom now then, I'll need you to come with me. Revelio. Lumos. Now for the rest of you. <laughs> Lumos. Can bring them. Lumos. Narada will be happy about this. Your gift from the Mer people was exactly where they said it would be. Wonderful news! I was so worried I'd left it too long and they'd seen it as a slight. Our relationship with them is already so tenuous. I quite like the idea of an authentic Murmish artifact. I'm tempted to keep it myself. What? Why would you do that? That gift was a gesture of goodwill, a symbol of hope. I was going to show it to the Ministry! 
If you really wanted this, then perhaps you should have fetched it yourself. I would! If I knew how to swim. I just hope you haven't set relations between wizard kind and mer people back decades. That's it! I shall definitely need to learn how to swim. Or use a bubble head charm. Your gift from the Mer people. Then I'm glad we helped to foster some healthy diplomatic relations. Merlin's beard. It's marvelous. I'm going to show it to everyone, including the Ministry. Should I hand deliver it or send by owl? Thank you again so much. You may have just helped improve relations between wizard kind and Mer people for decades to come. I can't wait to stop. I quite... I know, I know. I was only joking, it's all yours. Oh, good. You scared me for a moment. <laughs> May I see it? Merlin's beard. It's marvellous. I'm going to show it to... E Thank you again. I can't wait to study this.